third edition of the Christmas festivity nonsense. Today I am bringing you a Mate in 3 by the famous, I think, Czech composer called Wenda, W-E-N-D-A, if you would like to look him up. Um, and the lovely dude has created this uh, awesome Mate in 3 puzzle that I would like to share with you now. I reckon this is solvable, so um, if you fancy solving this uh, on your own instead of listening to me, then please pause the video here and uh, try your luck. If you would like to, on the other hand, just uh, see it in my own demonstration, then uh, that's what we shall do. Um, yep, so the solution to the problem is bishop e7. And the idea behind this fantabulous move is that if I move the bishop on this diagonal anywhere else, I'm going to obstruct one of my line moving pieces towards the seventh rank, which is the key to this problem. So basically what we want to do is to wait um, and um, yeah, um, see which pawn moves away so that we can uh, eventually give a checkmate. Please note that uh, here doesn't work with the intention of mate down there because this one promotes with a check and then with another check and uh, it just drags out too long. So, bishop e7, let's have a look at how this mechanism works. It's quite beautiful actually. So if the, the dude takes on c1 and gets a queen, we play queen d7 and now if the queen gets pinned in the hope that now it won't be able to deliver the checkmate, then the bad news for black is that this discovered check actually does deliver the said mate and this basically sets up the whole puzzle as far as what the motive is if they take the queen then we go to c7 and once again if the queen tries to obstruct by attacking the attacker then we now drop the bishop back to c5 again blocking of the c file and giving a checkmate uh, to the black king and finally in an equally similar manner if we take on uh, c1 then rook b7 queen b2 and now bishop b4 is the checkmate so it's a very clever switchback mechanism that works here the only remainder uh, that needs to be said is that after a3 we just simply take the pawn and now black, uh, black must take one of our heavy dudes and in doing so must open up one of them towards the seventh rank and thereby allowing a mate on the seventh. A cute little puzzle, quite enjoyable. I thought it would uh, fit very well into our theme today. Um, so I hope you guys liked it and I will be back with the next tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye.